Hey, what's up guys? Nick here today bringing a brand new video. Today we're doing the vehicle only Warzone challenge. So a couple of weeks ago we did the random vehicle challenge, which goes by the title. We could only use the random vehicle Rex, but this one I can use whatever vehicle I want. If I see it and I have enough Rex for it, I can take it out, but I cannot shoot any weapons. I can't melee people, only vehicles. So this will be very tough. It's going to be really, really hard as the only way I can go up Rex is by killing people. So I'm going to have to get like a Mongus or something at the very beginning. So I'm going to jump into a Warzone game, see how I do. And uh, this one will hopefully be kind of interesting. Okay guys, so we've got a game on March on Stormbreak, which is kind of a good thing. I think this will be a really good map for this challenge as there's plenty of open spaces. As long as everyone doesn't kind of stick in the middle area, then I should be okay. Uh, but for the very start of this game, I'm allowed to melee the AIs just to kind of get us past this first part. It doesn't really count as an actual Spartan kill. And as soon as I get outside, then it's vehicles only. I can't even melee people, uh, which is going to be a bit of a pain in the ass, to be honest with you. I didn't even get to kill one AI, so I d didn't even have to say that. Okay, we're going to start off nice and smart with a Warthog. I'm hoping I can get a teammate to uh, get into the gunner seat. And if I can somehow wiggle my way into the gunner seat and they are driving, that would be even more perfect. But I'm not holding my breath. As long as I get someone in the back here, I'll be happy enough. Anyone? There's like five of you here. So one person wants to get in. One one of you. I'm Uber Nick. Get in your Uber. All right, perfect. Good. All right, now it's time to go kick some ass. So we're going to take the long way around and hopefully not run into too much opposition around here. But you're probably all thinking, Nick, why are you doing this after doing the random vehicle challenge? Well, after I did that challenge, I really wanted to do this one as with the random vehicle challenge, I kind of was limited to what I could do. You know, I was kind of dependent on getting random uh, vehicles and stuff like that. I'd say I wanted to use a Banshee or a Ghost or something. I, I couldn't because I would just have to wait on what I was given. Uh, but with this, I can at least, you know, have a bit of fun. If I feel like flying a Banshee or then going into a Wraith, which is probably not going to happen, but if I do feel like that, I now have the freedom to do that and see how I do. So far, I have not been able to get any kills here, but hopefully I can run into someone soon, quite literally run into them, uh, instead of just getting constantly sprayed down here. That guy, he just went through the turret. I swear to God he did. Come on. One of you. Come on, get in the gunner seat. I dare you. Dude, I that is so bullshit. I mean, I'm not going to cry over it, but god damn, that was... That was annoying. I just, every single person was just bouncing off my warthog or just avoiding me by like two inches. Up until I get to the ghost stage, this is going to be difficult because I have to wait for someone to actually get in, which is going to be kind of annoying. Okay, I'm going to go for a bit more of a ramming machine this time and just try and get in there, ram some people, get the level three wreck, and then I can actually start getting some wrecks out that can do some damage to people because currently I'm trying to run them over and it's just proving to not work very well whatsoever. I'm going for it, guys. I'm just going for it. I'm like free willy. Okay, that didn't work. Oh uh, shit. Okay. Through the fucking backseat window. He got me with a needler. Bullshit. Okay, we've got our ghost. This is good. Now it means that I can actually try and kill people with an actual turret that I have. You know, the ghost isn't the most powerful uh, vehicle in the world, but it's better than a warthog that I can't actually shoot from. Okay, he just took so many shots, but at least I got him. And there's a double kill. So it's already looking better right off the bat with this ghost. Oh, is he, is he dead? Yes, he is. Thank you. Thank you for dying, my friend. Please check again and come back in the future. Come on, where is this guy? There you go. He's now dead. That's where he is. There you go. Okay, we're doing a lot better with this ghost. This feels good. <gasps> Holy shiitake mushrooms. What are you doing here? Okay, we're actually gonna run away from this guy because I would rather not die. <gasps> I nearly took my teammate out, but we're all good. I didn't touch him. There he is. The guy is... Oh my god, teammate. What are you doing? Oh, what the... What just happened to my ghost? All right, we're out of here. I see you. I see you. <sighs> That's so satisfying. All right, this guy here and this ghost doesn't seem to want to go away. So, oh, uh, there's two of them. Of course. Of course there's two of them. Okay, we're going to take to the skies this time and get a wasp. Uh, I don't know how this is going to work for me. Uh, hopefully good. That guy, <laughs> those guys just kind of fell off the map together. It's kind of sweet. But, uh, oh no. What are you doing to me? There's, why are there so many wasps in this, or ghosts in this game? I don't understand. Okay, we got him. That's good. Oh, another wasp. Are you, two wasps. There's two of them. Really? Oh man, that's just unfortunate. Okay, so while I'm on the ground like this, the only thing that I can do is try and hijack other enemies' uh, vehicles and hopefully 
you know, take it from them, I suppose, or if my, my teammate is in something that has a gun receipt, I can jump in that as well, but I'm not allowed to shoot people, I'm not allowed to melee them, if I get a kill that way, we'll just not count it, but I'm going to try my best and not even shoot at people. This is where this challenge gets very hard, because whenever I'm on low on wreck or something, I, I can't really do much at all, because I have to wait until I have a semi-higher wreck. Oh, and there's a Mongus! Okay, we're still on this thing, this is now our, uh, our ride for the next couple of minutes, unless we get blown up straight away, which is uh, more than likely. Yeah, we're so dead. No, we're not. I actually got a kill. Did not expect that whatsoever. All right, teammate, I don't know what you're doing here, but you're not really doing much. You're kind of just chucking nades repeatedly at nothing. L you're literally chucking nades at ourselves at this state. Dude, you're chucking grenades at ourselves here. What are you doing? Stop. Have a bit of sense in your throwing. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, you just keep throwing your grenades. I hope you're having. I hope you feel fulfilled with your life right now. Right, throw them at this mongus at least, or this uh, ghost. Oh, oh, come on! Can he throw it at the go uh, Can he throw it at the ghost? No, he can't. No, he no, he can't. Damn it! That thing just took to way too much damage. Right, we can now get a banshee, which is uh, gonna hopefully be a little bit of fun. Never really been that good at them for whatever reason, but uh, at least I took out that wasp. That's, that's something at least. But it took me about a year of this game being out to fully realize how I do the spinny stuff, uh, the acrobatics, the aero acrobatics. Uh, but now that I've learned, that's something at least, I suppose. There's a kill. Okay, yep, uh, just, yep, that's another banshee got me. <laughs> God damn it. And that is why I cannot have nice things, because I try and do something, and then someone has to do it, and then take away my nice thing, aka, I get a banshee out, another guy, another guy gets a banshee out, and he kills my banshee, when I didn't even try and look at him. I didn't even look at that guy, and he killed me. It's just mean. So it is. Okay. Kind of, yeah, I'm kind of screwed here. As there's no vehicles that I see in the, uh, in the area. So I'm going to try and maybe sneak one off someone. But I don't know how that's going to go. Now uh, there's two ghosts here. If one of these guys died, you know, I feel bad for them. But at the same time, I wouldn't because I'll just take their ghost off them. So low-key hoping one of them dies. At the same time, this guy here is kind of having a bit of issues. Yep, away he goes. Holy shit. Okay, there's a scorpion. Okay, not trying to deal with that today. No thanks. But if I could maybe try and hijack it, that would be a cool idea. Nope, he totally wants to kill me. He knows exactly what I want to do. And it's he, he doesn't want me to do it, basically. Yeah, he knows where I am. This is this is not going to end well for me whatsoever. We're going for it, boys. We're going for it. Holy shit, no way we're actually going to do this. I can't believe it. Holy shit, we actually did it. Well, I'm a hero. Okay, killed myself, but it's all good. I, I can't believe... I managed to get that scorpion. Okay, we're actually gonna do something I never do and get a scorpion out because, to be honest with you, I kind of forget they exist half the time and I never really do that great in them. I uh, should have got Wheelman out before I did this. I'm, I'm just thinking. So I'm gonna try and see if I can get over there to the, the, to the home base and get it. Chances are probably not. Probably get hijacked or something or blown up in some way before I get there. But, you know, it, it's... <laughs> It's, it's worth the, it's worth trying. Okay, people are kind of just rolling into my field of view here, and I'm just shooting them. So if you want to keep doing that for me, that is just perfect. Okay, we're just gonna go back to home base here, get Wheelman, and then we we'll be right back in the action. We're gonna fire one one shot for luck here. No, nope, if that killed someone, it probably would have squealed. So it's be better that I didn't, I guess. And before a teammate comes and steals my scorpion, I I can, I can just see that happening right now. Okay, we've got our Wheelman. Our scorpion is just sitting there waiting for us. And now we are ready to get back into the field, back into the action, and kill some red team. That was super cringy. Uh, I do apologize. You know, these things are cool and all, but I, I wish they were a little bit quicker. I wish you could, like, I don't know, have a speed boost, but for vehicles. That, that would be cool. That's, that's actually a good idea. Maybe I should go and work for 343. It's not a terrible idea. But just when I'm rolling by here, I have a couple things I want to tell you guys. So first of all... A couple of you have noticed that I have got way better thumbnails in the last month or so, and that is all thanks to a person called Bailey. Bailey is the person that has been making my thumbnails over the last month or so, and she's done a fantastic job. All of you guys have said they're so much better looking now, and uh, I want to give a shout out to her. So a link to her Twitter is in the description bar down below. So if you want to check out her Twitter where she posts some of her work and stuff, then go check her out, give her a follow, and she just does incredible work, and uh, I really do owe her a lot for all the success on the channel over the last month or so. I did not shoot that guy, but I still got the kill. Not gonna complain, but 
I do feel bad for him because he kind of got uh, a little bit cheated. I see so many people down there, but I can't get an angle on them. That's so upsetting. Hey, what? Dude, no. No, this is not going to happen. This is not going to happen. No. My scorpion. I thought Wheelman was meant to like make that not happen. I guess I was lied to. Any vehicle you're seated in quickly recovers from EMP effects. Oh, okay. I thought it just meant like you didn't get affected by EMPs, but... I guess I've been living a lie this entire time. That feels really bad. All right, we're getting another one out because I do not want to waste my time. I do not want to waste a scorpion. So number two is coming out. Let's get some more kills. Okay, the second thing I want to talk about as well is this weekend, I'm going to London to the HCS or Halo World Championship event that is going on there. What the fuck was that? Oh, okay. I thought an enemy shot me and I was about to get super pissed. All right, teammate, instead of shooting me in the back, shoot the fucking wraith here, would you? I'm gonna actually fucking flip. Uh, that's unbelievable. Fuck race. Fuck race. But this weekend I'm going to the HCS Gfinity event in uh, in London. That's being held at Wembley. So if any of you guys are going there, uh, keep a lookout for me. I'm going Saturday on Sunday as I'm very tall and ginger. So if any of you are going by any chance, I'll probably be pretty easy to, you know, pick out in the crowd. So that'd be awesome to potentially meet some of you there. I'm so goddamn upset by that fucking friendly race. I know he couldn't shoot over me, but... He like distracted the shit out of me and then by the time I turned around it was too late it was already over so I'm not gonna blame the friendly wraith but I'm gonna say it was like 3% his fault that I died but just while I'm vehicleless just while I'm kind of you know trying to find one that I can steal or potentially jump in the gunner seat of someone I want you all to leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite vehicle in Halo 5 is maybe it is the scorpion maybe it is the phaeton now is like me my favorite vehicle is the phaeton which i'm desperately trying to work towards here it's just not going very well for me at the moment uh, leave a comment down below letting me know what it is as uh, i'd be very interested in reading what you all have to say and also if you could make one vehicle of your complete dreams if you could think of a vehicle an idea for it uh and you'd like to see it in halo what is it what is your idea i think i'll be pretty cool i'm thinking maybe like a flyable scorpion uh because you know they're not very fast so if you had one that could fly it would make travel a lot quicker in them. Yo, wh wh why are you not dead yet? Why? Why are you not dead? I don't know how I didn't kill him. I, I would never understand. So yeah, flyable scorpion. The, the, the scorp she. That, yeah, a scorpion band. It doesn't make sense, but just... Just let your imagination go wild. Okay, we've got ourselves a phaeton here, which is... Which is good. A phaeton is good. It, it just should... It should hopefully equal some kills. You know, a phaeton Helios would be even better. But I'll take what I'm given. I'll take what I can get at this certain time. I don't even have eight wrecks yet, so I can't even get the Helios. But if I'm able to, that will be cool. But uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see. Because that Hannibal Wasp across the map is not my friend whatsoever. So he can go screw off. He can just go forget. Ever being invited to my birthday party. Never going to happen. Dude, look at him. Go on, Banshee. Go beat him up. Be my friend. Beat him up. Tell him to leave your friend alone. He's literally keeping me away from them from across the map. I literally can't even get close. And he's across the map from me. I might just have to get in there and see what I can do. I might just have to kind of try and bully him a bit and just rush him. I'm going for it. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're dead. Screw you, you little, you little rat. Okay, the scorpion back there is also terrifying me. But we're good. We managed to escape the scorpion. Holy shit. All right, okay. You know, I'll take that as a mini victory of my own uh, with this because I did not think I was going to be able to kill him, to be honest. I just didn't see it happening, but we managed to. Okay, the scorpion's there. If I'm not careful, the scorpion will just beat, beat the shit out of me. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm terrified, I'm not going to lie. Oh, fuck, a marine got me. Really? You know, the Phaetons are not as powerful as I once thought they were. It just, you can defend against them basically no problem. The Helios would have been a lot better there, as I could have, you know, shot them with my laser and, sh and stuff. Okay, so the Phaeton Helios would have been a lot better in that situation, but, you know, I take what I'm given. The the Phaeton itself was not that great, as they're kind of kind of easy to defend against, but whatever. I'm not going to cry about it. But I managed to get this Banshee, uh, which is good. It's a little bit beat up, but I'll take what I'm given. It's kind of like a second-hand Banshee that I have right now, you know, which is better than nothing, I suppose. Oh my god. Hello? Okay, guys, so unfortunately my Xbox disconnected from the internet as it's been doing that quite a lot recently, as uh, this is actually my second attempt at recording this video, but every time it disconnects from the internet, which is... Uh, 
kind of really annoying. But the game was basically over anyway. I got to use all the vehicles that I really wanted to. I got to use the Scorpion twice. Got to use my Phaeton. Uh, didn't really do that well with it, but I managed to kill the Hannibal Wasp, which was kind of like my, my arch nemesis at that time. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button down below. I'm sorry we didn't get to finish the video, but I'm having severe internet issues and I just, I can't make videos whenever I have no internet. So I've been kind of using the little gaps of time of the internet that I have uh, throughout the day. So I managed to get two full games and then it's cut off now. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed the video. But thanks for watching the video, guys. Hopefully I see some of you at Gfinity in London this weekend. It should be hopefully a good time. Even if you're not going, you can watch the live stream and maybe see me there. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.